Good morning! Good morning, world! It is 7 a.m. and we have Foundations of Nursing Zoom this morning. Only 30 degrees. 30 degrees outside. Kaylee, my roommate, will not get out of bed. Now it's time for makeup. reason I'm actually wearing a nice outfit and not a hoodie. Okay, now it's the point where I stack on all of the concealer under my eyes because I don't sleep at night. So I'm going to transform to look at least a little presentable today. I am a nursing major. I'm a visual communications major. And I'm also a nursing major. And we are going to show our OOTDs because for once, I'm not wearing a hoodie and leggings, which is <laughs> crazy. Okay, so as you can see, the pretty room decor also, we have a traffic cone that we um, borrowed. <laughs> I am wearing the Air Forces and some Nike socks, ripped jeans, a t-shirt, and a turtleneck because it's 30 degrees outside. Then I have my chokers and my jewelry. This is my luxury handmade, hand woven sweatshirt with my beautiful leggings. I have my laundry and in my the background. Air and I tried really hard on my hair today. <laughs> I curled it so good. Okay, now we are walking to anatomy and our anatomy professor wears a different Hawaiian shirt every single Friday. So I'll show you Asnikar's Hawaiian shirt of the day and it should be interesting. We're doing a drawing assignment. So we're super excited to be artists today. Yay! Gaznikar and I teach anatomy and physiology and Fridays I wear a Hawaiian shirt. <laughs> Okay, so it is now 9.52, we just got out of anatomy, and this is our prime nap time because we don't have chemistry till 12.20. So we are going to feed our fish, Finley, and then take a nap. This is Finney, he's our fish, and we feed him a little pinch of fishy flakes every day. Just woke up from our nap, and we are about to go to chemistry, our favorite class. Yay. Okay, now is the time where I do my laundry. It is about 1.30, and a lot of people are in classes right now, so you kind of have to figure out the perfect time to do your laundry and find out when no one's using the laundry machines because in Evans in my home we only have two washers so you kind of it's like a competition to find a wash. So I haven't exactly had time this whole week to fold my clean laundry and so that's what I'm going to do right now. I usually watch a documentary or listen to a podcast while I do my laundry. Also Fridays are usually when I get my life together and clean up my side of the room and wipe everything down which is super important right now because of COVID. So it is now two o'clock and I have 45 minutes until I have a meeting with my advisor. And so lately I've been really intentional to just save some time and be with Jesus and I have been reading the 100 days to brave devotion then I also have my prayer journal which is so important to me and 
I love writing in it and just spending time with the Lord. And then I also have my Bible. I usually just wait until I have my own space and my roommate's gone or I can be somewhere alone so I can listen to worship music and really just take the time to be with the Lord because here at college it's super hard to find that alone time and I think it's super important especially for your mental health and just to keep yourself sane to incorporate that into your day. I just got done with my devotion and I'm actually about to go to a meeting with my nursing advisor because everybody is scheduling for the spring semester classes and I am actually in the middle of changing majors. I really think that the Lord was talking to me today through this devotion. Something that really stuck out to me and I wrote down was, He did not design our minds to figure out the future. That is beyond our capability. He crafted our minds for continual communication with Him. Bring Him all your needs, your hopes, and fears. Commit everything into His care. Turn from the path of planning to the path of peace. And I think that's super important. I think, especially as college students, we just always think about the future and we want everything to go as we plan, but we always forget that the Lord has our book written for us already. We also have main tags to put on the dryer and the washer so that they're being used and no one takes our clothes. and I am about to go to my meeting with my nursing advisor. I have to go to the fifth floor of Ott and I'm super excited to meet with her. Now we are going to the student center and Carly has to pick up a package and then we are going to get Macan. So super excited. So good. Okay, we are now in the bookstore and we are just looking around. Everything is so cute and I want it all, but I need to eat my muffin. Okay, we are at our unit dinner and we are about to go carve pumpkins. Woo! Here is one North Evans. <laughs> and I got tater tots <laughs> and pizza <laughs> and a zebra cake. So we're eating good tonight. We are about to carve pumpkins. We have Natalie and Carly and I think we're gonna do a minion on our pumpkin. <laughs> Kayla, um, eating cake bites right now. Our pumpkin is the best pumpkin. Hey! And we are making it here. Let's show her. Look, it has teeth. Beautiful. She's a queen. Beauty. Love her. We're gonna win. Period. the piazza again it is nine o'clock cool. and we are picking our friend up some wings hi vlog it is now much later and i am working on my foundations of nursing homework now i'm working on chapters 12 and 13 of our medical terms each week we get a new chapter of med terms and because of covid we have to print off our own worksheets and then we take a picture and we upload it on our brightspace <laughs> 